Hi, Air Science, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support. In this reading, we're going to get you an update on how the person on your mind feel about you right now. Today is the 6th of August, 2023. Time here in Hoi An, Vietnam is 7.15 p.m. Please bear in mind that is a collective reading for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. And if you were to finally got it to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Person on your mind right now, how do they feel about them? Now think about the person you like to know. How do they feel about you? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between the two of you. We've got the strength card here. They either could be holding back or that they feel like you're holding back. There's somebody here with a bit of a pride, um, prideful energy, right? Um, Ten of Swords here is a one first, indicates a release. So they could be feeling as though um, that you've released them um, or that they could be feeling as though they need to release you. And then Seven of Pentacles here is also in reverse, indicates another release. Not a wand here, it's in reverse. Basically, just like, you know, I can't do this anymore, that kind of an energy. Either they feel like you, you can't do this anymore, you've released them, and that you've taken a different path, you've started something else, something new, not a Pentacles, you're doing your own thing, or it could be them. Feeling like maybe I need to release air signs, I need to be strong, and with the will of fortune, if our paths cross again, if there's a second chance, um, ace of wands, I might be open to it, right? Because uh, ace of wands can, can indicate somebody reigniting passion with someone. So bear in mind, different versions take what resonates with you, okay? Air signs, but... Again, it could go vice versa as well. And the page pentacles here is along first. They could be feeling like they need to hold back from talking to you, telling you something, telling you that perhaps they would like to have a second chance. It's the ones who like to reignite passion with you. However, it could also be them feeling as though you not talking to them is a sign that you have already moved on, that you've taken a different direction, different path. And with the ace of wands here, that maybe, you know, there's something new in your life. It could be your new, uh, a new idea, a new uh, perspective, a new way of thinking, a very independent way of thinking with the Nine of Pentacles. So they could be feeling as though that you are very independent and they like that about you. Unless if you're separated from this person, they may feel like you're very independent and that you don't need them. Um, so they could be holding back from talking to you or reaching out to you, okay? From taking any actions towards you. King of Wands here is in one first. So the person in your mind could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. However, air signs, if this is someone relatively new in your life, I feel like ten of swords in one first, they could be feeling like, oh, air signs change me, right? Change the way I feel. It makes me feel as though I can now release my pain, my anger, my sadness, and will fortune can indicate a change. And perhaps Page of Pentacles and first, they don't want to talk to uh, these people from their past who may have hurt them. The moon here is among first. feels like they don't doubt you at all, that they could be holding back from telling you all, all of these things because, you know, they feel like maybe that's the right thing to do, right? Again, few different scenarios here to state what resonates with you. And the will of fortune is like, I'm so lucky to have met air signs. But, you know, the king of wands in my verse, I don't want to come off desperate. I don't want to come off as though I want this so bad. But I'm interested to see what's going to happen. Because the ace of wands is new, right? New beginning. I'm interested. I'm interested to see where this goes. I do sense some feeling as though that they do respect you for being somewhat independent. Um, you have a lot of qualities, good qualities in you that they 
respect that they admire. Uh, perhaps you're somebody very self-sufficient or you're very elegant, very beautiful, very gorgeous, okay? The moon here is in well first. It does feel like they have no doubt about you, who you are as a person, what you're capable of, okay? Unless, again, if both of you are separated from each other, they could be feeling like, okay, I don't know if I should open up and talk to air signs. I don't know if we should reconcile or give this situation or this connection a second chance. I don't want to take actions yet. I feel like with the strength here, um, they could be feeling as though that they need to be very tactful in dealing this situation with you. Especially if this is someone you are separated from. Okay, let's pull out more cards here. Let's see more. Page of Cups, they do feel like you are a breath of fresh air, somebody very different, or somebody different from the usual type, or the way you think, how creative you are, you're very different, very cute, this is a very cute energy for me, um, well, this could apply to anybody, right, I mean, this could be someone new, or someone from your past, or some, whoever you could be dealing with, again, even, even if there's someone from your past, I do sense them still having a lot of respect, for you, a lot of respect for you, regardless of what happened, what had happened between the two of you, but this could also be someone new, feeling like I respect, I respect air signs. I think air signs is very different. Uh, they make me feel something different or see things very differently. Okay, and ten of pentacles is right here. They may feel like wow. Okay, maybe both of us could build something together. Unless if you're separated from this person, they could be feeling as though, you know, maybe they have to eventually come forward and say something to you in regards to the future. Um, could also have something, to, it may have something to do with home situation, money or children, if you have children with this person. There's something that I feel like they would like to tell you, uh, they would like to propose to you, but I sense them feeling like they have to be nice to you, okay? Um, and with the Nine of Swords, but they feel like you could be upset with them. But they would like to propose something to you in regards to the future. Um, the Eight of Swords, they've been thinking a lot about you, about the future, or what to say to you. I sense them feeling like they need to be careful with you because you may be upset with them, or that it might trigger something in you. And then we've got the Justice here in World First. They may feel sorry about treating you unfairly, something that's unjust, something that's unfair in this situation that they may be feeling like, okay, I need to talk to air signs about this, but I don't know what to say. It assaults. I need to be very careful because you might greet them with hostility with the Knight of Swords. You might tell them to, you know, F off, you know. And then we've got the Knight of Cups here in my first. Um, I do sense this person holding back from feeling something for you or feeling deeper for you. I sense them also feeling as though that they don't want, to, they could be controlling their feelings, okay? So they don't want to say something wrong, do something wrong. And this can apply to someone who whom you are separated from or some someone new, okay? I do sense them feeling like you're somebody intelligent and you will call them out, you tell them the truth. Um, but they're kind of fearful of what they might hear from you, what will come out of your mouth, right? So I do sense them feeling as though that they need to be very careful with you, around you, whatever they say to you, how they are, how they are appearing to you. I feel like it's very important to this person, okay? Hmm. They feel like you have everything, like almost everything, like all the good qualities. I do sense them actually respecting you or who you are. But also, also at the same time, it's like I need to be careful. Okay. But again, if you're separated from this person, I sense them feeling like I need to be careful um, around air signs. But... I need to hold back from feeling too much. I need to do the best that I can to forget about air signs. But I do hope in some way, shape or form in the future that 
Maybe our paths will cross, and perhaps both of you will have this second chance. I sense them not feeling like they shouldn't take any actions towards you as of right now, but hoping in the future, when it's the right time, that perhaps both of you will have the second chance to reconnect. I do sense them feeling sorry for some injustice here with the justice in our first. And if you're upset with somebody, this person was on your mind, if you're actually upset with them, I do sense them feeling like, yeah, you had all the rights to be upset with them. All right, Air Science, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Vlogs, my travel channel. And I've been pretty active on that channel lately because, you know, I don't want to abandon my channel, <laughs> my second channel. Um, on that channel, as you guys, some of you may know that I'm a nomad, I travel. So I'll bring you to eat with me, uh, try different food, go to the beach or go to all of these attractions, tourist attractions or even not tourist attractions and tell you how much everything costs. I think it could be informational, okay, and along the way, I've made, uh, recently I've been telling a lot of stories as well, uh, from my past experiences, anything, anything that comes to mind, but anyway, check that channel out if you are interested, if not, it's fine too, hope to see you back here again sooner than later, take care, guys, bye.